Hi there, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how to patch meltdown and CPU vulnerability bug in Windows 10. Hope you find this guide useful. If you do, please help me out by subscribing to my channel. Okay, so recently in the news there's been um, a vulnerability found in, uh, it's basically in the hardware, not in the actual Windows operating system, where you could actually take over a machine um, using a CPU bug. So to patch this, what we need to do is, if you have antivirus on your system, you need to stop it because uh, this update needs to write some uh, files to certain locations and also needs to put some registry entries in, on your machine. Um, it's possible that some antiviruses will block that. So disable your antivirus temporarily for this update process. Uh, next thing you need to do is if you just left click on the start menu then click on settings we basically need to run Windows updates so if you click on update and security and then if you click on check on updates this is then going to pull the Microsoft website it's going to look at your machine and it's going to download any um, hot fixes and updates that are not installed in your machine so when this scan is finished uh, you'll be able to click on the button to automatically download and install the updates so we can see here it's actually listed which updates are available uh, we can see here it's downloading updates uh, depending on how many updates you have it could take um, a long time to download I'm just going to pause the video while it downloads Okay, the updates have finished downloading and they're now automatically getting installed. So when this process is finished, it will prompt you to reboot. If you then restart your machine, uh, these updates will then be activated. Uh, just make sure you reactivate your antivirus afterwards as well. Make sure that's running and then you'll be protected from uh, the meltdown and CPU vulnerability. Also, I'd recommend that you repeat this process once a month because uh, every second Tuesday of the month Microsoft will release these new updates um, publicly uh, so if you run Windows Update once a month it will then download these updates and automatically install them in your machine and you'll be protected from the latest uh, threats okay if you've got any questions on this process please post them in a comment below and I'll help you out uh, but thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video